uh, COVID border restrictions in place two years ago. The region with the largest number of vacancies is central. That encompasses Whanganui, Hawke's Bay, the capital region and Wairarapa. Just under 800 full-time roles are needing to be filled. The departments with the greatest need, mental health and critical care. In the rest of the country, close to 600 full-time nursing positions exist in the northern region, which covers Auckland and Northland. And Midland and Southland regions combined need more than 400. There's been an influx of nurses from overseas, but some are yet to see patients. To explain, here's Corazon Miller with her exclusive report. American nurses Kate and Grant Wright moved here in January and have recently bought a home. Armed with years of US experience, finding a job's been easy. And so there were two different places that we had looked. Um, so we, we looked here and then we'd also looked in Nelson. The couple filling hard to staff roles. She's a nurse practitioner. He's in Wellington's intensive care unit. We wanted to have a feel of permanence here, put down roots. Um, Make it, make it feel like home, especially for our kids. Staffing numbers have been improving overall, but the nursing union still worried about pressure on senior staff. It remains because we have senior nurses fed up and leaving. We don't have, we have deficit in some areas of the knowledge and skills. Health New Zealand's numbers show mental health and emergency areas remain particularly hard to fully staff. And make a difference somewhere different. So it's expanded on its global recruitment efforts. Mental health workers sharing their stories. And you get some lifelong friendships. In a campaign designed to bring in more from the UK, Canada, USA and South Africa. Seeing some really good early interest coming in and our international recruitment teams in partnership with our hospitals hospitals and our NGO partners will be focusing on starting to process those expressions of interest in the coming weeks. Definitely foresee some uh, of our fellow nurses coming over, um, hopefully, and joining us in um, Aotearoa. While New Zealand's natural beauty is a selling point, recruiters say it's still a challenge to find the numbers we need. There's still a global shortage of registered nurses, really good, very experienced registered nurses. And now the main countries that we can recruit from are Canada, only some states, USA, Singapore, UK, Ireland, Australia. Those from other countries are required to do additional training to work here. Nursing Council figures show more than 2,500 of them 